There are thousands of children who go to school here at San Diego Academy, but also at other schools that are nearby all around here. This is really a cluster of schools right here. And so focusing on this roadway, this east-west roadway of Santa Fe Drive, and making sure that kids can get safely to school and that people who are driving on the road can also be as safe as possible is really important. There's a lot of work to be done. We will continue to strive for that and we will also work to make improvements to all of our key corridors of east-west travel. On the evening of June 22nd, while riding his e-bike and changing lanes, he was fatally hit by a van that took his life way too soon. Wearing his helmet, knowing the rules of the road, signaling clearly on that tragic day was not enough to keep him safe. Preventing bike collisions with motor vehicles involves a combination of education, infrastructure improvements, improved safety measures, dedicated bike lanes, investing in our law enforcement and lowering our speed limits can all greatly enhance safety. What happened to Brody and the loss our family is suffering could have been prevented. We should never allow this to happen again. Brody should be here at school right now. And he's not. And we have failed him. His death could have been prevented with clearly marked dedicated bike lanes and much needed traffic calming measures in our community. We have to do better for Brody and prioritize the safety of our bikers. We as a community have to change with the changing times and join the many cities investing in improving bike infrastructure. E-bikes are not going away. E-bikes have seen a significant growth on a global scale. So right now it's our responsibility to Brody to create an environment that cyclists, e-bike riders, and drivers can all safely coexist on the streets of Encinitas 